10 year this is a 10 year old female child and we, there is a swelling in this region which is in the uh, this is the sternocleidomastoid muscle this is one and the sternum here is the swelling and this is in the anterior triangle of the neck what is here what is this swelling let's see on the ultrasound Here you see the uh, right lobe of the thyroid because the area of interest is on the right side in the, in the anterior triangle of the neck. But this is important to see that the right uh, uh, thyroid in transfer section, this one, this white area, shows norm, is normal. And uh, this is the common carotid artery. This is the jugular vein. This is the sternocleidal mustard muscle. Okay. Now I'm going to show you the sternocleidomastoid muscle. I have placed the probe of the other bit over the uh, sternocleidomastoid muscle, bit of the nickel, as it shall. This one. Now this strip is in fact that of the sternocleidomastoid muscle. This one. And when I move the probe medially over the swelling, swelled area, we see a huge pocket full of echo, echo filled pocket. This one with no flow, thick wall is uh, now. It's only three point one mm deep. Okay, let's say three point three mm deep to the skin in the region in the right triangle of the neck, and uh, this is the cystic area filled with echoes that we are studying. Now this is the longitudinal view of the same measures approximately 2.4 centimeter by 12 cent at 1.2 centimeters. Now this is the transfer section. Here. No calcification is seen in it. Now this is the sternocleidomastoid muscle. This is the uh, ecofield cystic uh, area, thick wall. This is the sternocleidomastoid muscle on the right side, and this is a. Now we do not see significant posterior wall enhancement in this through this cystic area because of the thickness of the echoes. The reason is uh, the echoes are so thick throughout and is filling all of the cystic space that uh, by the time they reach the posterior wall, they are attenuated significantly. Patient is not tender to the probe. There is no redness over there, and uh, I do not have the lab profile with me. There are two lymph nodes seen in this region, one and two. And you will see no blood flow in this. Low are the vessels. These are, this is the vessel. So though two lymph nodes are seen on the right side of the neck, this is the medial one. This is the lateral one in longitudinal section and these are in transfer section. This one and this one. 
also suggestive of this finding of today is suggestive of an abscess, loculated abscess in this uh, anterior triangle of the neck with adjacent adenopathy. Thank you very much.